I want to tell you why the Casio WS1600H has the best timer I have ever seen on a Casio watch. You get two different kinds of timers. The first mode is called a preset timer, and I wish this was standard on every single Casio. I don't have this on a single G-Shock that I own, nor another Casio. A lot of the time, you're probably setting a timer for 10 minutes, 15 minutes, half an hour. Well, this has nine preset timers built into it. Just by pressing this upper left button, you can go between 10 minutes, 12 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes, 35 minutes, 40 and 45 minutes. And it cycles back between them whenever you press this single button. I find this so handy as not as often am I setting my timer for 11 minutes and 12 seconds as I want to set it for 10 minutes or half an hour. So Casio, please put this preset timer function on more watch modules. Also included with this preset timer is an auto repeat function, meaning it can start at 15 minutes, count down to zero and start the countdown all over again. Now I have seen an auto repeating timer in other watches. However, this one has a counter down in the bottom right, and this is going to count how many repeat cycles it has done up to hundred. So I haven't seen that feature and it's kind of cool. The timer includes one more feature, and this is another one that I haven't seen on a Casio watch module before. If you don't have the auto repeat turned on, when this counts down to zero and the alarm goes off, it also starts counting up an elapsed time of how much time has passed since the timer has went off. Just a cool feature, you can say, okay, my timer went off and it's been another five minutes so far and counting all the way up to 60 minutes. So it'll count up to an hour after your timer goes off. When you press the bottom left button one more time, you go to a completely different timer mode and they call this the countdown timer mode, but I call this the interval timer mode. Now you can set your one interval if you just want to have this function as a countdown timer, but set your own time, not use a preset time. Well, you can set this in five second intervals up to 59 minutes and 55 seconds. You can set auto repeat for your custom timer as well. And it also has that little counter that's going to give you the amount of times it's auto repeated up to hundred. With this mode though, you can also do a nine interval timer, meaning you can set one interval to five minutes, then a one minute for rest, another five minutes, one minute for rest, so on up to nine minutes. But keep in mind, each one of these intervals can be 59 minutes and 55 seconds. So you could have it time an entire soccer game or something like that. And this function also gets an auto repeat, but keep in mind, it auto repeats once the entire interval cycle has been completed rather than auto repeating for any one single interval. So that's the timer you get on the Casio WS1600H. For the timer functions on this watch alone, I think it is definitely worth the cost of admission.